Warning, this video or fanfiction most likely contains sexual themes and swearing. If you are uncomfortable with that subject, I would suggest you to proceed with caution. With the disclaimer out of the way, let's get on to the video. Again, because no one asked for it, we're back with the West Fig. Yay! This time we're on chapter three. So, let's begin. <clears throat> Phil placed the plant in the corner of his living room, and he watered it every day as usual. Dan and Phil were both sitting on the couch. Wait, does this take place after the first two chapters, or does it play on the different time period, or what? I don't know. And Phil looked over to the houseplant and started getting horny. Ugh! No! No! No, 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 no. I'm sorry. I just read some very smutty fan fiction before this. By accident, I swear. I There wasn't a rating on it. Really, there wasn't. And no, 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 no. Please, Phil, don't, don't, don't commence in sexual activities with a houseplant. No, no. He let out a moan and Dan looked at him, confused. He... <laughs> He looked over to where <laughs> he looked over to where Phil was looking at. After seeing he was staring at the house plant, he bit his lip at the sight of Phil getting horny. Dan also had a fetish that no one knew about. <laughs> Dan also had a fetish that no one knew about. Um, he had a Maltesers fetish. Wait, what are Maltesers? That candy. Oh. So it's candy did so many wonderful things to him and turned him on so much he would let moan he would let out moans like crazy. Ah! He always hits them so Phil won't find them. Suddenly Phil started to get hungry and he thought his new plant deserved a snack. Phil quickly ran to the kitchen and something caught his eyes. A red wrapper. Phil went and opened a box which was hidden in the corner of the kitchen. <laughs> Then he slowly started to open the box which of which was full of Maltesers and Dan's cereal. <laughs> Phil was too distracted with the box that he couldn't hear Dan screaming for help. Wait, what happened to wait, what happened to Dan? What happened to Dan? As Phil started to go back, he noticed that Dan and his houseplant being attacked by Phil's other plants. He dropped the Maltesers and ran to his new houseplant. Then he saw his old houseplants all had the face of Kanye and his new plant which had the face of a Pepe. Okay, so you weren't kidding in chapter two when they when you said that these were meme plants, I believe. Phil quickly grabbed a knife and stabbed the Kanye face plants. The plants crafted what? Crafted what? Dying slowly and have Maltesers spilling out of them. Dan suddenly let out a loud moan. <laughs> I keep sporadically bursting into laughter with this stupid, stupid story. Oh my goodness. Phil turns around to see Dan's pantless and shoving the Maltesers up his ass. <laughs> shoving the Maltesers up his ass. The meme, the, the meme plant quickly turned back to normal, and the Pepe meme came to life. Phil and Pepe went to Dan and started helping him. Oh, how it, how are they helping him? Like, did they pull the Maltesers, the Maltesers out of his butthole? Did they do that? After Dan had 3,000 Maltesers up his ass, Kanye's soul started to attack Phil. Dan started to shoot the candy out his ass and quickly killed Kanye and Phil. The poor living meme was sad that Phil had died because his dank memes were too much. Dude came from the attic. Wait, who's dude? And stabbed Dan. Dan was... Oh, wait. Bleh. Then there's just a Lenny face. Mmm. Dan was awakened to feel humping his body. Lenny face, Lenny face, Lenny face, Lenny face, Lenny face, or... Mmm, 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 mmm. Or dig, 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 as one person pronounced it. Well, we're finally finished with this. I don't think I'll be reading any more fan fiction for a while. After I finish this entire story, I'm probably not going to go back to fan fiction for a very, very long time. <sighs> okay, the problem was I stumbled across some real people fan fiction by accident, which was kind of, I don't know, two historical figures of the Middle Ages. Um, uh, <laughs> I don't want to talk about it. I, I don't want to talk about it. Well... Okay then, we're finally done with this. Or at least I'm finally done with the third chapter. Five more chapters to go. 
In the meantime, see you in the next video. Bye!